Hello everyone, how's it going? Age Graceful here. Good to see you guys. It has been a little bit. I've been very busy the last week. I'm feeling a lot better and I want to thank you guys again for all your well wishes. So today I'm here to do a few things. Number one, I want a giveaway. And the giveaway was uh, for... Uh, Day of the Dead, which I never celebrated uh, coming up as a child. I only celebrated Halloween, so I'm just now learning about Day of the Dead, but it was a giveaway sponsored by Red December 02, and I'm going to link her information in my description box, but she has the cutest channel. She is Cute and pretty as can be. She has beautiful dogs. You would just love her channel. She's so thoughtful and caring and so sincere. So I got this package actually the last day of uh, Day of the Dead, which was November the 2nd. Unfortunately, it was too late for me to set everything out. And uh, I didn't have time anyway because I had a funeral. So I am going to open this package and let's just see what's in it. I remember a few of the things, but I'm going to open it with you guys. There's a zip tie here. And the first thing I see, oh, and I sure hate that it got here a little bit late. The cutest pumpkin. And it's actually a card, and it says, Michelle, congrats on being the winner of my giveaway. Congrats to you on your one-year anniversary. Oh, thank you, Red. You are so sweet. Your channel is an inspiration. Love, Red, Black Beauty, and Tasha. Happy Day of the Dead. And Black Beauty and Tasha are the dogs. So, again, a little cute pumpkin card. So I'm going to set that to the side and let's get to the goodies. And she has everything individually wrapped. So I love the color purple. This is like purple or lilac. So it's tissue paper. I'm going to open this. Okay, so this is a scarf. And I love these colors. As a child, every picture that I drew had these same colors in it. I don't know what I was making, but I'm drawn to like turquoise and pink and like the kind of apple green color. So it's kind of late this year, but guess who's going to be first for next year, Red? It will be me. So I got a scarf. And next in this packaging, another package wrapped in tissue paper. She made sure these things were going to arrive safely, and I appreciate that. Okay, so that's the paper. Now inside of here, this is like a styrofoam bag to protect it. And I think I know what this one is. She did show all the prizes that were going to be included in her giveaway. Okay, I got it. Uh-oh. Oh, this is so cute. Let me get it out. I don't want to break it. Okay, so... This is the bottom portion. And this is a tea light holder. Yeah, burn within sight. It's a tea light holder, but it's a skull. And it has a cover so that you can uh, smother out your flame. Oh, you know what? It's not a, a top. It's an actual tea light. It's the uh, kind that's LED. I don't know if you can see that light. I cut it on, but... 
I think my ring light is so uh, light that you can't see the flame. But this is really cute. So it's a skull with a tea light. Okay, so let me set that to the side. I don't want it to break. Let's see what's next. Okay, some more tissue paper. Oh, these are too cute. They're dolls. A boy and a girl doll. The Day of the Dead. Too cute. So, I guess I need to name them. I'll have to think of a name. Maybe Black Beauty and maybe Tasha. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section what should I name these dolls. At any rate, they will be front and center next year during Day of the Dead. And I just want to thank you again, Red, for being so thoughtful. And I appreciate you. Thank you. Okay. So, moving forward, as you guys know, I've been sick. So, I have a stockpile of products and boxes that I did not get a chance to open. So, what I want to do really quick, Ricky's Cult Crushes. Now, if you remember, I wasn't crazy about the first one. The second one was a lot better. So, I said three strikes and you're out. And um, so, I did kind of care for the third box, but I, I still said I'm going to cut it off. But for some reason, I was sent a fourth box. So, actually, this was the... Is it the September or October? No, this was the October Ricky's Cult Crushes. So I'm going to open this box and let's see what's inside and see if I made a good decision to uh, stop, stop the subscription or should I have kept it. So I have my trusty knife here. Okay, so right on top, you see the um, confetti paper, and it's in black, and then you have the card. So, it just says uh, Cult Crushes on the card, and it doesn't say if there's a version number on the card or not, but I'm going to let you know what's in the box. Uh for this October box, I got CNF Hydrating Lip Mask. Then I also received Grande Lip Stay Put Lip Liner. And then I also got NYX Liquid Lingerie and Ruffle Trim. And then the LA Splash Lumos Highlighting Palette. So there's supposed to be four items in this box. So a lip patch. Okay, lip mask. So this is the hydrating lip mask. And it's in the shape of lips. And I am assuming that you would just open this and place it on your lips and leave it for a certain amount of time. So direction says, cleanse the lips and then after cleaning, open the tray and paste the patch to match the lip shape. After 15 to 20 minutes, remove the patch and gently tap the remaining essence into your skin so it can be absorbed. Uh, for external use only, avoid contact with eyes. And that's it. Chew. Hashtag chew. Hashtag kiss kiss. Hashtag lovely lips. So I'm going to have to try this one evening to see how it works. This is a uh, cooler weather now and your lips do become chapped. So this might just come in handy. So that's item number one. Now let me move this 
confetti paper to the side. The next thing that I see is the NYX lingerie. Uh, what was it again? Liquid lingerie and ruffle trim. So this is the tube and the packaging. And I like this color. I'm not going to open it now. I have so many open lipsticks. And if I have a color similar to this, which I think I might, then I might just put this in a future giveaway. So I'm not going to open it at this point. But it is a beautiful color. It is kind of like a, I would say, rosy type of nude rosy pinky nude it's very pretty color so that was item number two item number three is the grande stay put invisible lip liner and it actually comes in a box um on the back it tells you what it's going to do one prevents bleeding Two, contours the lip shape, and three, fills in lip lines. Those are the benefits of using this. No need for other lip liners goes with all lipstick colors. So that's different. This is a picture of what it looks like here on the side of the box. But I'm going to open it. So I can see what it looks like. So this is a really pretty gold pen or pencil. Let's remove the top. And it actually looks waxy. And I'm not quite sure how that would work. I'm drawing a line on the back of my hand. Can you see that line? So we're going to have to try to use this one day when I do a look just to see how it's really going to work. But this is the color that's supposed to go with every lipstick shade. So this was different. Okay, so... Ricky's Cult Crushes is a $14 per month uh, subscription. Okay, here's the last item. LA Splash Cosmetics. Nice packaging. And on the back it says that this product is animal cruelty free. And it's manufactured by John Dabbler Incorporated and made in the United States. So let's see what this looks like. It kind of slides out of this sleeve. And black case. And then it, oh, it comes with a mirror. So. I'm going to turn it up this way so you can see the colors. I'm trying to find a good spot to put this in so it'll focus on the colors. It's kind of hard, but the one at the bottom is called Jinx, and it's kind of a rosy color. The one next to it is called Lumos, and it's kind of like a creamy beige color. Oh, and the one next to it is very pretty. It's kind of gold. It's called Illuminate. And the one next to that is a deeper, like, bronzy gold, and it's called Hex. And I just wish that I could pick up the colors a little bit better. I think when I have it like this, you can kind of see... The color's better than when I turn it towards you. Just because of the lighting. And I just got home from work, so I don't have any natural daylight. I'm just using the ring light. And I think it's focusing in slightly. But these are some very pretty colors. And probably could even be used as a shadow uh, shades 
And they're all, of course, shimmers. So it's very pretty. So at the end of the day, is this box worth $14? Probably so. Um, but I've already canceled my subscription to Ricky's Cult Crushes. In fact, this was the very first box that was the, the majority were makeup products. And there was only one, well, lip care, skin care product in the box. So this box, I think they did a pretty good job on. Maybe I didn't give it um, a full chance. Um, would I go back? I don't think so because I get so many products from the other subscriptions that I get. So probably not. Um, so we'll give this L.A. Splash Cosmetics Highlighter Palette a try in one of my future looks. So I appreciate you guys watching this evening. I want you to take care and be safe. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care now. Bye.